I'm meteorologist Julie Broughton. Researchers at the University of Florida are testing a new type of cattle feed that could make dairy farming more sustainable. You've probably heard that cows are a source of greenhouse gas. Well, this new study takes the approach to change what comes out of a cow. You have to redesign what goes in. At the University of Florida's dairy unit, they've turned milk production into a science. Our goal is to make the cows more efficient possible. So we want them to convert what they eat into milk. And the science says a happy cow. Right, right now they're lounging, they're just enjoying. Is a productive cow. We want to make sure they're very comfortable because the more comfortable they are, the more milk they produce. And they're producing a lot. All day, you'll see the cows lined up like shoppers on Black Friday. They're waiting to be milked. Each cow produces about 80 to 100 pounds of milk a day. Per cow? Yes. Okay, that's a lot. <laughs> but it comes with a cost in the form of methane, powerful greenhouse gas. Fur, so she has no fur, and that makes her a little more tolerant to the heat. Gator Debbie here is a three-year-old Holstein. She has a curiosity for cameras and a role to play in climate change. Cows, they produce methane, which not only is a problem for the environment, but also it's a problem for the cows because methane gets eructated through their mouths like a burp. That's right, a burp. You see, as the cows eat, and they eat a lot, they burp, and that's how the methane is released. Some estimates say one cow can produce 250 to 500 liters of methane each day. So they lose about 8% of the total energy as methane. And if we can reduce methane, then they are more likely to produce more and be less of impact for the environment. I met with Dr. Antonio Fasciola, associate professor at UF's Department of Animal Sciences, to see how a new food additive may help. It's made with flaxseed and pea protein. In a lab, they measured how the supplement, rich in omega-3 fatty acids and proteins, reduced methane by about 20%. As an added benefit, it also improved overall digestion. So how exciting is this research for you to see it making progress? It's very exciting because the nature of research is that there is a lot of work and many times we don't see what we thought we are going to see. Uh, in this case, we actually saw very positive results. Fewer burps and more milk from Gator Debbie, a cooler planet for all of us. We only have one planet so far that we, that we live in. If, you, if you're vegan or not, or if you eat dairy or not, it affects all of us. Julie Broughton, News 6.